Okay everybody, here we have the HTC Thunderbolt and what I'm going to demonstrate for you today is how to disable the LTE portion of your network on your phone and strictly use 3G for those of you who don't want the high speed 4G LTE but only want to use 3G and also increase your battery life. Now you'll be able to find my instructions written down on androidcentral.com, they put them up on their blog today or if you take a look below, you'll see that I've also put instructions up for you. At any rate, what I'm going to do is show you how to get into the testing menu on the HTC Thunderbolt so that you can turn off your LTE radio with ease. Now for those of you who feel uncomfortable about it, don't do it, but it's pretty simple, won't harm your phone. Now if you take a look, <clears throat> you'll see that we are on 4G LTE right now. A little difficult to see but it's a 400G with LTE next to it. Go ahead and unlock your phone and what we're gonna do is access your dialer. Once you're in your dialer, you wanna enter this code. Star, pound, star, pound, four, six, three, six, pound, star, pound, and then star one more time. This is going to bring you into your testing menu and the first thing you're going to see is phone information at the top, so go ahead and click on that. Once you're in phone info, scroll down just a little bit, and you'll see this option here that says preferred network type. You're going to be set to C CDMA plus LTE slash EVDO auto. This is 3G, 4G automatic toggle. Open up that drop down list, and you'll see there's a bunch of options in here. Click the one at the very top that says CDMA auto. Okay, so we'll click that one like that. Now what you'll notice is that this will automatically drop the LTE symbol. And in a second you'll see it'll pop up with just strictly 3G. And hard to see, but there it is. That's a 3 and a G. So we're no longer on LTE. And I'll tell you that myself, I've gained about 10 hours of battery life on a full charge by turning off the LTE whenever I don't want it. And like you, I, I don't want it on all the time. So, when you're done, go ahead and leave the menu by pressing home. But now I need to show you how to turn that back on. And there's just two more steps you have to do. So once you're back in this menu, follow the steps that I showed you before. You should be on CDMA Auto. And what you need to do is click on the menu. First, you need to check the one at the bottom that says LTE Mode. And you'll see that my 4G LTE is now turned back on. Okay? Then, before you leave the menu, one more time, you need to hit the menu, the, this drop-down box, and click on CDMA plus LTE EVDO Auto, like that. So now, it'll begin toggling between 3G and 4G again whenever it can find the 4G signal. So, uh, there you have it. That should take care of your LTE problems until Verizon releases an app for toggling. And uh, everybody enjoy.